Hey guys, I have another unboxing for you today. Last time out, we did the Vivo Nex S, then I brought you a review, and then I brought you some tips and tricks early on today. But today we have something special. The next fully all screen bezel is designed for. I have with me right here, the brand new Oppo Find X. So let's open this puppy up in this unboxing video. I won't get into too much detail. So first thing we notice here is this nice, I guess, dotty futuristic style in the box it says oppo and obviously it looks like it slides out there i'm not sure why it's orange but i mean this is the glacier blue 8 gig 128 gig model uh so i'm just gonna go straight in here open this guy up this is not a review unit so if this is a retail package this is exactly how you would open it if you were to buy the phone okay now you take a look at this and I slide this out. Find X. Wow, that's kind of cool. It's got like a little globe there, like a little atlas thing going on here. It's actually kind of cool. If you take a look at that, I guess they kind of try to make it snazzy. Um, yeah, let's let's actually pop this open. Let's see what's in here. Well, okay, that just pops right up over there. So there is the phone. I'm gonna take that out. Oh. I've really stuck that in there. Okay, take that out. Just put this beautiful phone. It actually looks kind of small. It looks quite good. I like that. And let's get to the box. So, boring stuff. Oh my goodness. And here I was worrying about a cover. Holy crap. People were asking, what about the cover? What's going to happen? There's no cover. Look at this cover. Just look at this. Have you ever? My goodness. That just tells you all about this phone right there you can't have rounded corners there do not drop it on its top it will smash but putting it on a table so it doesn't get scratched that is a nice little cover i, I like that i was going to say that the next s wins hands down just because they include such a nice cover this cover doesn't seem as great but it seems pretty stand up and if they have this going on they're going to make a whole bunch of third-party covers for this one which is good news uh, people are always worry about the cover so that's a good thing but here we have the pin of course, we have the little 3.5 millimeter jack converter to USB type C over there. You can't really see. I'm not going to open that up. Um, you guys know what that is. There's no 3.5 jack on the phone, unfortunately, like the Nexus does have. We have some papers over here and we have a nice little cloth to keep it clean. I guess they want you to keep this around for all that mildew and stuff that gets in the lens. You can clean it up. So yeah, let's pop that to the side over there. We're all done with that. And let's see what's in the box here. Oh, we got some earphones that kind of look like Apple AirPods. Well, not AirPods, I guess, AirPods. I guess they're okay. I'll probably never use them, but it's cool that they include earphones. Ooh. Oh, I'm assuming that the cable is, is packed up in here. So how do I open this up? Oh, here we go. Okay, I see what they've done here. So they've put the earphones in here and then they've also put the charging cable in here. So, so oh wow, they even have little covers protecting the cable. And there's the nice three port, um, USB type C port over there, which is quite cool. It has a nice little cover. It's a nice little touch to it. All packed up neatly in there. Very neat packaging, I must say. And then this is the amazing charger that's supposed to charge your phone ridiculously quick. Can do that, I think. 2400 milliamps in less than 30 minutes, which is quite impressive. It should charge your entire phone, this phone at least. 3740 milliamp battery, I think, in around an hour. That'll be really impressive. I'll have more on that in the review. But yeah, let's, let's go ahead and just take a look. Now, I actually have the Glacier Blue one. I don't know if you guys have noticed, but many videos out there, it's, it's only showing the border red. It's only two color variants in this, so let's pop up in this Glacier Blue. Wow, look at that. My goodness, all black in the middle over there. When I look at it like this, it seems all black. But doing this with those blue edges, oh my goodness, that, wow. That is beautiful. That's one incredible smartphone. Look at that. Jeez, like it. Okay, so I've heard it, quite a few reviews talk about uh, this phone being symmetrical. So it is pretty symmetrical. I mean, if you look at the, the SIM tray here, this is dual SIM, by the way. No SD card slot option, but uh, it's quite symmetrical with the speaker over there wonder how that will perform. Um, then we've also got the 
the design of the the logo pretty symmetrical everything is just full on par but i mean at this price point you you should definitely expect that on the front you just oh wow you just see all screen look at that that is that is insane we have the, the lock button on the side over here this all the side over here this is all blue this is all blue so that's a nice little touch it looks like it's it's black sandwiched black sandwich glass with a blue aluminium touch in the middle it's quite nice it reminds me quite a lot of the samsung s8 and s9 um so yeah let's go ahead and turn this on quick so unlike unlike the vivo next s we actually have a physical mic up here uh well get a headphone earphone earpiece there with the with the vivo next s it's it vibrates through the screen so only time will tell which one's better but yeah okay so 4g lte Ooh. Sounds so fancy. Look at that screen. My goodness, the screen is beautiful. So I'm going to go ahead and skip through all of this stuff. I just want to show you guys. Oh, you can set a number of unlocking methods such as possible. Oh, face. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Let's hit back. Let's hit settings here. Okay. So enter, set a password. Okay, don't look at this. Don't look at this. Yeah, I'm going to keep this a secret from you guys. This is my, this is my little secret. Okay. I'm going to have to confirm this over here. Okay, enroll facial info. Now I'm wearing a cap, as you guys can see, but let's see how this does it. Whoa, did you guys just see that pop up? Look at me. There I am. Yeah, I even had a little smile there. That's already done. Body detection, all that stuff. Let's just hit next. Okay. Blah, 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 skip, skip, skip. Okay, continue, continue, agree. <sighs> Set up as a new Oppo phone, get started. Swipe up gesture navigation. Greatness. Oh, I love gesture. Wow, look at that screen. You can tell straight away this is a Samsung panel. Look at those punchy colors in that AMOLED screen. This is a beautiful phone. My goodness. Let's pull this down. Wow, look at that brightness. Holy. Yeah, that is a beautiful phone. Now, I just want to quickly do this now. You guys can obviously see here. Well, you actually can't see. This looks completely sealed up, 100% sealed up. You, you, it doesn't even look like there's anything. If I hit unlock here, okay, now I'm going to slide up the phone. Oh, my goodness. That was so quick. If you guys see my face here, just, just, just see my face over here. Okay. You ready for this? Slide. Oh, my goodness. This just made me so happy. <laughs> look at this. Look at this. Oh, wow. Look at that. Look at that. That is just a masterpiece right there. I mean, if I do this right over here, just so you guys can see this lift up. It's just so breathtaking. It is amazing to see that. Wow. Let's just go home there. That is really cool. This phone is impressing me. I was impressed with the Nexus, guys, but this phone is impressing me. Look at that. There's barely any chin there. This... This is a beautiful phone. So yeah, guys, I guess that's it for the unboxing video. I mean, I'm just gonna take a breath here for a bit and soak this in, play with it myself for a little bit. <laughs> I'll get back to you guys in the next week for sure and hit up a proper review on this guy. But yeah, for now, I'm impressed. I'm definitely impressed. This is the Oppo Find X. Let me know your thoughts below and please watch my previous videos on the Vivo Next S and be sure to subscribe to my channel. Until next time, guys, this is Technic.